Assalamu alaikum. I hope you all are doing fine. We are perfectly all right, alhamdulillah. Today I have brought the third part of my stove cleaning video. I started with using the cleaning product called Astonish Hop Cleaner. Then the next video was how I laid down the aluminum foil on the stove. And now the third part of the video is in which I will show you how I keep it clean what tricks do I use I use two different tricks but here in this video I will show you one trick in quite detail the other trick is very easy and that I'll just explain end of this video so as you can see on the foil there is some oil there is oil splashes on the tiles because I just finished up cooking and I thought I should quickly record this video so that I can show my tricks and tips that I use and which help me keep maintain the foil neat and clean and make it usable for even more than two months. I hope you will find these tricks usable. Let's get started. So for the first trick and the trick that I use every day, we need washing up liquid, a cloth, sponge and gloves. You might find it quite lengthy and maybe boring as well. But as I do it every day, I find it very easy and I just get my tiles and the aluminum foil clean in under 5 minutes. I use this trick end of the day so that next day when I come in the kitchen, the stove and the tiles will look sparkling clean. So here you can see that oil is on the foil and on the tiles as well. So the washing up liquid really makes them clean well. So before starting up, I will remove the grates and I will put them into the sink. If they need cleaning, I'll wash it over there. After that, I will just take sponge, I'll put a little bit of washing up liquid and I will start scrubbing the tiles and the aluminum foil. Here I will make sure that I will use the sponge very gently on the aluminum foil because I don't want it to rip off. Because you have seen in the previous videos, it takes longer to clean the stove and put the aluminum foil on. So here you can see with the help of the cloth I have started wiping it down and it took me like few minutes. I was done with the tiles and the stove. Another tip that I want to give you is that by any chance if the aluminum foil has ripped off which is very often to happen because we use the stove quite a lot. So what you need to do is you can fix it very easily. As you can see there is a part ripped off next to the knob. I just used a clear cello tape, stick it on, job done. So you don't have to remove the whole foil. So here I have put the grates back, everything looks sparkling clean and tidy. So this was the trick I use every day and I find it very easy because after using the washing up liquid. I have seen that my foil is always grease free, oil free and the tiles are always shining and this is what I like because whenever I wake up in the morning, I come to the kitchen, want to make breakfast or anything, I want my kitchen to look really neat and clean. Another simple trick is that if you don't want to go through the long process of using the washing up liquid, sponge, this and that, what you can do, you can use any sort of antiseptic wipes or any kitchen wipes and you can clean the tiles and the aluminum foil with them that would be much quicker so these were the two tricks that I wanted to share I use both but I find using the washing up liquid much better because as I said earlier it leaves everything sparkling clean waking up in the morning to a neat and clean and tidy kitchen gives me more energy and strength to keep me going because that's the place where we mums spend most of the day. So if it's not clean and tidy, of course, you don't feel like doing more work or more cooking. I hope you have enjoyed the video and I shall see you next time. Till then, take very good care of yourself and Allah Hafiz.